Welcome back. Yes, you are back with your boy Scarcious. We are in the Master League and we're starting off here with a Mewtwo Mirror match. This is a tricky one because you don't know if they're running Shadow Ball, Focus Blast, Ice Beam, who knows? Or if they're going to go for a bait, we go for a bait and we get their shield. And then now you got to figure out, are they going for a bait? We're not going to take the risk, we shield also. So we both baited each other here. And we're both built into a shadow ball, but he dips out. And we threw, so he's catching this move on his Dialga. But we're going to swap into Excadrill here, so we don't mind. We don't mind. So we're building up nicely here. Getting off a draw now. Are they letting it go? I don't see why they wouldn't. Yep, they let it go. Probably come back with a Mewtwo. Yes, of course. And then we get off another draw run here still. So do they want to shield this? Let's see. No, oh, they let that one go. Okay. Okay. Are we going to call that this is just a side strike and let it go? Yeah, so we'll survive that. Yeah. Can we get to another one? Yeah, they win CMP and they didn't over farm. So, yeah. We're going to go down and let that go. Come and lose you. Yeah. So, they're going to have to throw a Shadow Ball if they have it. This is the moment for them to reveal if they do have it or not. They do have it. But obviously Lugia can take that very well. And now they switch into their Giratina altered form. Altered. Now do we want to show this so that we can get off the arrow blast? If it's just a Dragon Claw, we should survive. It's a Shadow Snake, which we might have survived also though. But yeah, we're going for the Aero Blast now. They might think we're baiting. Let's see. Yeah, they let that one go. Nicely done. Let's force them to throw some energy. Yeah, they're going to throw the energy here. And then Excadrill should be able to come in and tidy things up. They go for a Dragon Claw, so we're going to survive that. Swapping out straight away. We're not going to allow them to over farm. Whatever move they want to throw here, Mewtwo can take it. And then we should be able to farm them down. Or we'll throw the move if we feel like. We'll farm them down. That's a GG, man. Nicely done, though. We know the vibes. Okay. Into the next one, though. Who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be? Okay, Palkia. Okay. We don't mind too much. We don't mind too much. Building up. We're gonna get off theirs first. I was trying to figure out if they were gonna dip out or not. Some dip out, some stay. Some stay, but we'll give up one shield. For them to win this, they, um, they're going to have to give up a shield. And yeah. We don't fancy giving up no shield. We're going to get off our second side strike quickly, not playing around because they're about to get to their Aquatel. So if they want to give us a shield, they do. And now they can farm us down, but that's fine. We've got a shield off them, so we can come in Lugia. If they go for Aquatel, that's absolutely fine. Or will it be a Draco? It's an Aquatel that does nothing. Now we can just farm it down. Yep, nice. Who do they want to come in with? It's going to be a Metagross. So we swap straight away into our X control. And then they come in with Station. Okay. Okay, let's see what the vibe is though. Let's see how they're Feeling like they're building up to two close combats, that's fine. They're gonna debuff themselves soon. 
uh, and we still have two shields, so we are absolutely fine, you know. Absolutely fine. They're gonna debuff themselves, and then we're gonna throw the drill on here. This will take them out as they have debuffed themselves. They might want to shield and get off another close combat. They do shield it, but that's absolutely fine. We still have another shield. We should be able to get to the next drill run, which will take them out. And then the Metagross will have to come and face a drill run because they are unshielded. All right, over farming by one. All right, this will take out their Zation. Bring back that Metagross. He's gonna have to eat a drill run right now. Eat this. And then we should be able to go into Lugia. And Lugia can tank a charge move from the Metagross pretty easily, so it's already a GG and they know that. You know the vibes. Into the next one. We're gonna move swiftly. <laughs> GG's though, for sure, for sure. Mm -hmm. Alright, into the next one. Okay, Landorus. We don't mind this. This is where we want to see it. Okay. Let's see what they're feeling like. Got that beam for them. Alright, let's see. Let's see though. Let's see though. Are they giving up a shield? Do they know what the vibe is? Oi, oi. <laughs> let's go. <laughs> let's go. Oh my god. That is so satisfying. In comes give bell to we get to another ice beam do you think we're just gonna bait now that we know they know we got the beam they showed it out rightfully so cmp we don't need to show we can let it go we go down with you two come in extra drill we still got two shields we're looking good got to be careful that they don't try and catch the rock slide okay they let that go they don't want to give up that second shield yet it looks like obviously you have to be careful of the focus blast but even at this stage you got to be careful of the dark pulse also we want to keep extra drill nice and healthy Can let this go if we want to though but how we feeling yeah we feel like shielding that we feel like ed schedule is going to be putting in a lot of work and yeah he will because they got a meta cross in the back so you're not catching a rock slide buddy eat this draw run eat that jeez that's nice you can throw another one and you swap into lugia over farming as much as we can before they get to a medium match. Throw this draw and a dip straight into Lugia should be the plan. Yep, get that last shield and then swap into Lugia. And yeah, you can already see where this one is heading. Actually surprised that they're actually still sticking around. Um because I don't see any wing clone for them. But yeah. Fair play to them. GG Nicely done. And Excadrill's real naughty. He's naughty. You don't want to be at a shoulder disadvantage when we got Excadrill. With nice energy. Come on, man. Alright. Into the next one, face up against a melt metal. We don't mind this at all. And of course, we're going to bait that we got Focus Blast and see what they're feeling like. We throw a rock slide most likely. Yeah, rock slide. We're building up. Let's threaten them, make them feel like we got that focus blast. Let's see what they're feeling like. Do they want to give up a shield? No. Okay. They don't feel for it, that's fine. We still win this matchup. So Still very positive for us. And we still want to give up some shields. Do they want to give up a shield or do they want to dip out? Some decide to dip out, some decide to shield. 
Let's see what a vibe is, shall we? What do they want to do here? Moment of truth. They stick around. You can't win CMP against me too. So you're going to go down unless you decide to shield. What do they want to do? There they go. Absolutely fine with us. And then they come in with Garchomp. That's absolutely fine, though. We can come in Lugia. Dragon Tail will put in some work. Unless they want to swap, do they? They might throw a sand to him and then dip. Or an outrage and then dip. It's a sand tomb. Okay, are they sticking around? They are, surprisingly. Hmm. Now they dip. Okay, and then we <laughs> they dip into Togekiss and then we can dip into Excadrill. And yeah, you can already see where this one is heading. Alright, so we're going to start getting off them rock slides. They may decide to double shield. Let's see. We're going to let the first one go. We're going to throw another one. This will take out the Togekiss if they decide not to shield. But I feel like they will. Let's see. Yep, they will. And they do. And now they get to a charge move. I'm going to shield this up. Okay, we go for the ancient power. And then we can just build, we can even over farm a bit and get a bit more energy if we like. And we throw the rock slide here. Are they letting it go? Yeah, they let it go. Gonna come back guard up now. Can we get to a charge move before going down? Yes, we can. Alright, this will get the last shield. Yep, now we can just come in Lugia and finish the job, man. Let's go. There's no charge move that Garchomp can throw here that's going to take Lugia out from this range. So they go for the Sand Tomb and that's just not going to cut it. So yeah, they know it too. So we don't even bother throwing a charge move. Just drag it until they're done and they top left. And that's a GG, you know the vibes. Come on, man. Let's move swiftly, though, into the next one. Okay, who's it gonna be? Landorus again, okay. You lot already know how this one goes. We got that beam for them. <laughs> got that ice beam, it's about to get real cold out here. Do they think it's gonna be a side strike and no shield? Let's go. Okay, this guy's smart. But he's given up a shield. We don't even have to shield if we don't want it. But we can shield and put pressure on them. Force them to make a decision if they want to dip out here. And they do dip out into their Mewtwo. So we dip out into our Lugia. If they're not running Shadow Ball, then it's going to be a bit of a tragic one for them. Let's see what the vibe is. We'll see what they got. It is. Ice Beam, okay. So they're really running the same moveset that we've got on our Mewtwo also. We throw a Sky Attack here because they're about to get to another Ice Beam, so let's pressure them to shield. We don't, maybe we'll track in our energy. Um, do we want to shield? Mm. We decide not to, do we survive this? Just barely. Can we get to the sky attack? We do. Great call. Great decision. This will take them out. So they might decide to shield this. Will it take them out? Yeah, it will. They were very low there. All right, we're going to get taken out by one fast move here. Yep, and it is Dialga. Okay, Excadrill, your time. They're going to have to switch out. Yeah, they do swap out. <laughs> and then we swap into our V2. And yeah, it's going to be a rip for them. We should have went for the ice beam. I think they might have been tracking our energy. They might no shield this. Oh, they shielded it. They thought it was a beam. Okay. And we actually don't even need to shield this, you know? We actually don't need to shield this. But we do. Keeping Mewtwo nice and healthy. And yeah, they know the beam was coming. So they top left and that's a GG. That was the last battle. Thank you guys for coming by once again. I appreciate you all. Take care now. Peace.